chicka wow wow. It's Friday, fool, and you need this tool. Welcome back to another glorious episode of It's Friday Fool, You Need This Tool. My name is Kyle Voss, and every Friday I bring you a tool. A tool that is used here in this shop, or that has been featured on this channel. This week's tool was brought to me, this tool, this week's tool was recommended to me by one of you guys. That's right, I listen. This tool really is a good one. Why I didn't know about it, I don't know. It probably would have made my life a lot easier. Especially here lately with all the work that I've been doing with sheet metal and rivets. Am I giving it away? Hell, a bunch of them already guessed it anyway. So a couple videos back, I actually showed this tool. I think it was on maybe Saturday or Sunday's video. And I mentioned that it would be on this week's You Need This Tool. A lot of you guys already knew what it was. I really dig it. This thing is pretty cool. This week's tool is called the Rivet Fan Spacing Tool. Other than this thing just looking cool as hell, it's actually got a function. And the function is that it will automatically evenly space holes for you. So on the top of this thing, it's got holes on each one of these little tabs. And as you pull this thing out, they spread apart. And so if you're laying rivets, like I do a lot of times on the channel, and you want them evenly spaced, really if you're doing anything that you want evenly spaced, this is a great tool for that. Now you can just measure between the first two rivets. If you want an inch space, then you know once you get these two an inch apart that the rest of them are gonna be the same. Uh, this one is a 10 hole spacer. They also make a 20 hole spacer. It's a little bit bigger. And basically, if you wanted them to be further apart than this thing would do, you could just skip one. So, say you wanted them four inches apart or three inches apart. You just put one here, 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 here. Makes sense, right? This thing also has, and you won't be able to see it, probably, but it's got markings on here that say like three quarter one inch, one and a quarter, and one and a half. And each one of those has a line. And all you have to do is basically line the angle of this thing up with that line. And it should be very close to whatever the marking is on that particular one. This one here, like I said, is the 10, the 10 hole spacer. I gave $28 for this thing on Amazon. The 20 hole spacer runs about 35 bucks. It's pretty cool. I mean, it could definitely save you a lot of time depending on what you're doing. As I always do, I'll drop you some links in the description. You can go check them out. These are mainly used, I think, in the aircraft industry. This one actually came from an aircraft supply company. Seems to me the quality is really good. It's made of stainless. You don't have to worry about it rusting. It's just a cool tool. To be honest with you, I probably could use this thing. I mean, I'm always just eyeballing it even to me. This tool is really going to come in handy on the Bibster. Uh, I'll probably end up buying the bigger one also just so I can run longer runs of rivets. I mean worst case with something like this if you wanted to do a longer run you could lay out your your holes and then just move it down. Line the two up the last two that you did with the first two on this one and then continue on. Alright guys there you go this week's tool the rivet fan spacing tool. I mean, hell, I guess you could do like circles and stuff with it. Probably could also be a weapon. As always, thank you for joining me. I'll see you guys next week. It's Friday, fool!